we win. Hi, I'm Dave Goldberg, Clifford, Minnesota. My daughter, Tonya. And uh, we're going to just show you really quickly about this high-low loading chute from Real Tough. Um, one of the things that we've always struggled with was when you load semis or load stock trailers, you had to have two different heights. So in the past, we had one loading chute that went up to load semis. You could divert off and get another chute beside it for loading stock trailers. Now we have a loading chute that does both, plus it's portable. So we've got all the advantages of everything all put into one unit. When you first get your chute, your, your portable loading chute, high low, we'll call it, uh, the hitch is gonna be uh, slid in underneath here. So you got to slide this out, turn it around, takes a two inch ball, and there's a pin right in here to lock it in place and you can actually you can just pull it out and leave it out all the time while you're using it if you want to, and then just put it back in for transporting it. The other thing that's very important is that this comes with a lock in it. Do you need this lock in for transporting it? So this pin right here has to come out. That's the first thing you're gonna do and there's a spot right here to set it when you're not using it. So just run that into there. Okay. Okay, we have a stand on each side that has got a number of holes in it so that you can lock it at different heights. So I'm going to put a, a pin in it just to, just temporary to hold it here. Um, just, just for a second. on this side is going to run it from high to low so you can start right here this is going to reach it up you can pinch it up to whatever height you want to put it at lock it in the lock it in the height that you want it and then just let it back down and this is a brake winch, by the way, so that it'll just be reversing it to let it down. And now you're ready to go. I'm gonna let it down, put it in the bottom position so you can see how it will work. All sorts of, how you can load a stock trailer with this also. All right, here we have it in the, position for loading your stock trailer. Right on the back of it. On the back. And then here you can load right. Set it now to load right into a stock trailer. You can set this up for the height that you want it to reach your stock trailer height. Um, I want to show you some of the safety features of this. So uh, I've had a lot of people that have been worried about not lining up with the stock trailer or the semi. And what happens is there's a gap, and that's a place where the animal can get their foot through and a chance for it to get broken. So this is just ingenious, the way it pivots, and whatever you're going up against, you don't have to have it physically backed up and it'll line up and it'll prevent any gaps and this is a wonderful safety feature. Um, this is the other safety feature that Dad kind of mentioned, that you don't have to be perfectly against the stock trailer or the semi and you're able to fill that gap when you back up into that. Um, the other thing I want to point out too is about this hitch, is that it does push back completely out of the way. So you don't have to worry about losing your hitch. You can either pull it out or push it back and it's completely out of the way. Um, my other favorite thing about this um, high-low portable loading sheet, a couple things actually. The hooks on top, if you do need to move it, you can just uh, pick it up with those and go wherever you need to go. But I also love that you don't have to take off the tires. So no matter what you're doing, you don't have that hassle of taking them off, put them back, putting them back on. Leave them on and you can adjust it to any height and when you're done, hitch up, off down the road you go. 
this has been a great feature to this door. Um, if you want to stop the next one that's coming through the alley, you can use this as a stop. And now you can get in here and push the animals along and get them into the stock trailer, get them into the semi. Or you can just keep scurrying them along with this, keep prodding them and getting them into whatever you're loading them into. So there's been a lot of thought that's gone into it, and I wanted you to be able to see how you can raise and lower it, and I hope you're having a fantastic day. Thank you for watching.